Broke the wing off. Looked like we busted the front end up. Damn. Where's the other stuff at? Heat sink. Wing. Oh yeah, it's definitely done now. I can't fix it here. What's going on guys? Welcome back. So I promised y'all that we would do something different and guess what? We're gonna do something different. Where we're going right now, there's probably about 50 sheriffs there and it's gonna be dark. So this is gonna be our first ever attempt at a night run. So if you guys like this, Make sure to let me know y'all like this because if y'all do, then I'll take the truck all over the place and do night runs for you guys in all kinds of crazy spots. Or maybe we'll do both night and day. Either way, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Make sure to leave a like, subscribe. If you're new, my name is Don. I run Don's Tech and we're all about RC cars and gaming computers and technology and fun and doing crazy stuff too. I'm using a cell phone to light me up so you guys can see me. We're driving right now. As you can see, on our way there, this is going to be awesome. Alright. So this is how we're going to do it. We got the GoPro mounted, we got the lights on, everything is good to go. Let's go outside and get it going.
know what it is. Remember I was adjusting these and I was getting them right at zero degrees on camber? Apparently that's a bad idea because putting your truck at zero degrees barely puts the teeth inside of this cup. So whenever gears go up, it pulls the drive cap out and that's what's going on right now. So these are adjusted too much. So what I did is I put this one back in and then I tighten up the distance. I put about two degrees worth of negative camber back into the tire and I had no problems whatsoever. This one, however, I did not adjust. I left at zero and look what happened. The same freaking problem. All right, well, now I know how to fix it. So on a lovely side note, this is what I was talking about that broke the uh, differential op drive that's what broke and then of course we twisted the drive shaft when it caught it twisted it and bent it and now there's a bend in it so it's no good anyway i went ahead and purchased these so now they are going to be on their way so anyway uh we're at work and i thought i would show you guys this this says please join me in congratulating don front office manager that's right, so proud of you, Don. That's me. I got promoted. Promoted! Promoted! And I got a nice pay raise, which means that I can make more money to spend on RC cars and computer stuff. Awesome. Oh, by the way, we have a sheriff's convention in town right now, so let's go outside and see all of the different counties of cop cars that are in our parking lot it's ridiculous there's probably over 20 cop cars in our parking lot right now all right and if you were curious the number is 50 50 sheriffs staying here that's like more than some counties have on a whole force i know one of our counties over they only have like 20 something officers on the entire force but uh yeah just thought i'd show you guys this uh back to work here is another sheriff's car and here is another cop car yay and here is another cop car and here is another cop car here is another cop car and here is another cop car and here is another cop car with a another cop car undercover that cup is broken it's it's broke it's just busted open and it broke open and it caused the the dog bone to get thrown out that's what happened all right so yeah we are done for the night damn man that sucked so close oh well all right guys thank you for watching